Hi, my name is Ryan Ever, and today I'll be reviewing Resident Evil 4 for the PS2, although it's also available for other game consoles. Uh, you're probably familiar with the Resident Evil series that first came out on PlayStation, and they've made several other ones since then, and some spin-offs and all sorts of other things, uh, all of them focus around killing zombies in one way or another. However, this one is a dramatic departure from any of the other Resident Evils. Well, I'd call the other games, uh, horror, or adventure, survival horror maybe, this one's more of an action horror. Um, while this is not like a bad thing, it's very different, so if you're not used to it, or you're really used to the other Resident Evils, you might find it a bit different, since instead of just scrambling for, looking for ammo and trying to stab zombies, um, this one pits you up against a lot of zombies and you have plenty of ammo to spend, so that's, it's really different in that aspect. Um, let me show you some gameplay. It is easier to aim in this Resident Evil though I find. Um, however, it's very violent. And uh, with the shopkeeper you can even tune up your weapons. For instance, you can upgrade a weapon so that it has more firepower, or it reloads faster, or it can hold another more rounds of ammunition. As you can see, the graphics are okay. Um, some of the most impressive things are the physics uh, for the PS2 game console. Um, the story, eh, it's alright, but I don't believe that any of the other Resident Evil's have that good of a story. Um, but overall, if you like kind of horror games uh, and you like shooting a lot of zombies, I highly recommend this game to you.